up for Eyewitness News, call 12 for action. And for all our guy viewers out there, heads up. If you're thinking of popping the question but are terrified about buying an engagement ring, we've got you covered. Let's well, see, the next few months are the most popular to propose, and problem solver Susan Hogan helps you get down on one knee without breaking the bank. That's right. Congratulations, guys, on finding the right woman of your dreams. But now it's time to get to work. Before you get here, you've got to start here. We've got a systematic approach now to helping these young buyers uh, sort through the strategy, if you will, of picking the perfect diamond for the perfect ring for the perfect woman. To start, find a jeweler who can service you from beginning to end. Especially those with their own design workshop with the ability to not only sell the jewelry, but service it for the lifetime of the ring. Jewelers who can service your ring on the premises is key. Think about it, if a jeweler has to send out your ring for service or sizing, it will have to use a middleman, which then adds to the cost of the ring and also opens you up to problems. It's very important. It's a large investment financially and emotionally. Stick to your budget. A good jeweler will be able to work with what you can afford, not just sell you something because they have it in stock. Understand the four C's, but don't go crazy. Dealing with a jeweler who is certified through the Gemological Institute of America, they have the knowledge about the diamond since, well, let's face it, most of us don't. No matter how many nights and how many hours you spend on the internet researching diamond rings, you're not an expert. And that's why it's important to deal with someone who's been doing this for a very long time. And be willing to walk away empty-handed. They put the hard sell on you and take advantage of the fact that you don't know as much about the product as they do, and they either upsell you into something that you didn't need to purchase, or they sell you a lower quality item thinking that you purchased a higher quality item. And bottom line, buying a ring is about building a relationship with a jeweler. Even if you're on a budget, a reputable jeweler will still fully service you. So go with your gut, not your heart. Save that. For your vows. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228 1850. Or if you're interested in becoming a Call 12 for Action volunteer with me, you can call that same number you see right there on your screen. I'm problem solver Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.